I must speak with Morgana to go where she wishes. The living flesh always is a hindrance, but I must, I must go for our aura. The day that he first played the world. His friend Orca fell into a deep coma as a result of Skate's data drain. The world isn't just an online game. Something with another purpose is lurking within it. The Book of Twilight, handed to him by the girl Aura, transformed into a bracelet, giving him two extraordinary powers. Data Drain, the power to alter monster data, and gate hacking, which allows him to gain entrance into protected areas. And it was these very same powers that put Orca into a coma. I want to help Orca. With the help of the bracelet, he and his party succeeded in destroying Scathe. However... The true battle was about to begin. Yeah. 
Okay, let's go! We are going to the Dungeon of Theta, chosen hopeless nothingness, to find out what happened. It feels icky leaving it hanging like this. The bracelet, it's not shining. doesn't seem to have changed. Afraid? Who, me? Hmm. I'm not afraid. No way. Well, all right, I am. I'm scared enough for the both of us. 
My controller is soaked with sweat. So what about you, huh? Yeah, to be honest, I'm terrified. But I can't let that stop me now. You're right. But that graphic on the wall, it... Where? Where? It's my imagination, but it's just that for a moment it seemed to transform. Oh, don't ever scare me that way again. <laughs> it's not funny. Don't you dare smiley at me. Excuse me, but didn't something like this happen once before? Okay, I confess, I'm just a newbie that's trying to act big and tough, that's all. Go on, laugh at me if you want. <laughs> I want to ask you something. Now what? You're pissing me off. The reason I'm here is because I want to help Orca. Why are you here? I come here to discover the cause, and I find you again. Explain! Explain my ass! You don't know anything! I already told him the other day. Huh? You did? Now that you know, what's the problem? Don't you understand what we're doing? I do understand. But you need to face facts. With you two involved, things get worse. That's how I see it. Am I wrong? Man, I hate him. Maybe... Maybe he's just got his own reason, one that's different from ours. Let's go on ahead. It's a dead end. I guess we can't go back there again. You are the player that won the Power Up campaign, right? We had found out that the item we gave you has a defect that won't let you install it. We will exchange the item with the Book of Absolute. Power Up Campaign? What's that?
is this? I guess I'll go. I got a suspicious email instructing me to come here. You get one too? There's a clue to curing those who went into comas. That? Yeah. Hold on a sec. That's weird. Look, I can't gate out. Oh! What was that sound? Welcome. I am Leos, the system administrator of the world. You have ignored our warnings and have gone too far. If the two of you hadn't interfered, then the situation would not have deteriorated. You not only did nothing about the coma victims, but you also tried to cover up that fact. What about your actions? Viruses that were spread by hackers caused a series of problems. If you want to blame someone, blame them. Are you saying that if I blame someone, those who are in comas will awake and return to normal? Then, okay, sure. I'll accuse them all you want. Kazu's still in the hospital. Bring him back. Bring him back to normal. Bring him back. We are currently investigating the relationship between the world and those who fell comatose. We are not twiddling our thumbs, I assure you. We are working on countermeasures. But aside from that, to take immediate action to prevent the situation from worsening, it requires that you delete your character. Delete it? Why? You should know that your character violates the software usage agreement. Installation of an illegal effect. You do know what I'm referring to. I will delete you now. Wait a moment. Yeah. Helba! Leos. Do you want to be one of the lost ones as well? What? I wonder what would happen if the boy performed data drain. Right here and now. No way, I wouldn't do that. I know. Since you aren't stupid. The stupid one is this pig-headed man. You don't even understand how it works, yet you'll delete it before finding that out. Or do you even possess the ability to delete it in the first place? The boy's character data is so well protected, the system administrator can't even crack it. In spite of the fact that you developed a vaccine and disguised it as a rare item, Deleting those you cannot control is something that a pig head would do. <laughs> um, can I say something? I really don't care what happens to this character data. Hold on! Wait, what do you mean that you don't? It's true. Like I've said before, I simply want to help my friend. And that's all I want to do. Helba, system administrator, I need your advice. What should I do? I'm sorry, little boy. 
But I don't have the answer to your question. And I'm positive that Pighead there doesn't either. Although... Although... If the design of this world was based upon writings in the Epitaph of Twilight, it should provide you a clue. Forget it. Leos. Yeah, what? The code name given to a system administrator. Were you remotely aware that it's the name of the King of Lights that appears in the Epitaph? It is? <laughs> Silencing is not the only means of control. Why don't you observe them for a little while longer? I won't take orders from you. Orders? No, I'm only offering it as a suggestion. The net is spread throughout the world. If the problems escalate, can you accept responsibility? It's your decision. Uh, the decision is put on hold. Later I'll tell you the outcome. Later, eh? <laughs> Till then. Epitaph of Twilight. We haven't got enough to go on so far. Um, about the thing earlier. <sighs> no, forget it. Well, so long for today.